Hey guys, it's Rachel with the Certified Funnel Builders, and today we're going to be uh, working on fixing your page speed load time and helping improve that so that all your traffic stays and doesn't bounce right away. All right, um, so this pretty much works for websites, funnels, uh, any kind of landing page, anything. Um, this is kind of just for, uh, this is a basic, easy ways to uh, decrease your page load speed. Um, so... I was just working on this funnel here in ClickFunnels and I realized um, that when I loaded it, it was just taking way too long to load. Now I already went in and optimized it so it's moving a lot quicker now, but I'm just gonna go over some of the uh, things I did with images and videos to help the page load quicker. Um, I'm also gonna show y'all a tool that helped me uh, when figuring out what I could do. So I'm gonna hop over here into the editor and this is a ClickFunnels uh, 2.0 editor, but I know on Website Builders and the Classic, you can do this as well. Um, so uh, one thing I did was I went in and I made sure that all of my image files were JPGs, including my background images, all my little icons, um, these images. And then I also went in and made sure that they were the right size. Both of those are very important um, and can help increase or decrease your page loading time really easily. And that's something anybody can do. It's not that hard. Um, you can just Google like a converter and download your Im images in and they'll convert them to a different file for free. So I started by just doing that. And then I found this little um, website uptrends.com and they have a website speed tester and one thing i liked or there are two things i really liked about this one is that um it was free and they have desktop and mobile versions so you can t test both speeds as well as they have a lot of tools for figuring out what's taking so long but i'm just going to go over like the easy things that anybody can fix real quick um so if you keep scrolling down they have this timeline screenshots and this is super cool because it's it like shows you I'm gonna have to reload it again. Hang on one second. <laughs> Essentially, it shows you what is taking so long to load. So it shows you by like milliseconds what's loading and then like a, like how long everything's taking. Um, hopefully that pulls back up here in a second and I can show you guys. <laughs> Cause that helped me uh, just figure out what was taking so long on this page that I'm currently working on was the video. The video, we do have a really long sales video on the page, and uh, I figured that out in here. So let's see this. I don't know. <laughs> All right. Maybe we'll come back to it in a second. Um, while we're waiting on that, though, this is a really good tool, though. <laughs> while we're waiting on that, let's hop back over into the editor, and I can show you guys within ClickFunnels what I did. So this is a video that was taking so long to load, and I found that out through this uh, that tool. And then I just turned the lazy load on, and we uh, and I'll show you guys what that looks like in a minute. But then I went in and I did that for all the images as well. So I click on every little icon and image I have, and I came over to image settings and I made the lazy loading true. And it essentially makes it so that it doesn't load the images right when you load the page, it can load them as you scroll. Um, so I already have that saved, but I can show you guys right here what that looked like. So see how the images, uh, the video took a little bit longer uh, than the rest of the page to load. And so we don't really care about that because most people, will only wait two seconds for your page to load. If your page is taking longer than two seconds to load, they're probably just gonna leave because they're not patient enough. So as long as like something on the page is loading, it'll keep them there. And then if the video is just an extra second longer, it's not that big of a deal. Um, so we did that. And then you can see as I scroll right here, see how those testimonials were all blurry. Um, that's kind of what that lazy loading did, but they came in right clear right after a second. So that all works. Now, let's see if I can show you guys this. Okay, I think I can. So it has all of these like general information. And then you can go in and look at like the different things that are taking your uh, page a long time to load. But some of those are more high tech. We're just going to keep it simple today. Um, okay, this didn't even load the page that I was using. But it's still an example. See how it's showing you it took the video 
three uh, thousand milliseconds to load. So like in this instance, that's one of the things that's taking so long to load. So I might want to go in and make this video lazy loading. <laughs> But that's pretty much that tool right there, guys. And uh, that's just an easy way to optimize uh, your page speed and just make it go a little quicker and make sure you don't have customers bouncing right off the page. Um, I hope this was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe. And we do have something huge coming up next week. So guys, check the comments out. It's going to help everyone with uh, funnel launches and just making sure that everything goes right within your funnels and uh, helping you optimize and all sorts of things like that. So stay tuned and I'll talk to you guys soon.